Yo, what's up, guys? It's Chase, Arshon. I don't care anymore. And today, people, today we are uh, we're doing something a little different. Uh, if you guys remember, I want to say about what two weeks ago. Yeah, two weeks ago. I just checked. Two weeks ago, um, we I I did a little hot take video. I was doing some hot takes. I was in a bad mood. I did some hot takes. Whatever, whatever. Um, so I decided to do some more of my hot takes. <laughs> though in a, in a different way so i'm on twitter and i see that there's this thing that i, I won't say trending but I, I just came across it and so one has to go cartoon edition if you don't know how those things work they're going to give you a list of things they say yeah one of those things they, they gotta go uh so yeah i'll be telling you guys which one of these things have to go and right, cartoon edition because everyone want to do it for a living which is make cartoons i feel like i have um, no, a certain authority about <laughs> good quality. <laughs> um, but yeah, I think that that's pretty much all you gotta know. So yeah, let's get into this video. Okay, so you guys can see the keyboard, right? Uh, no, you cannot, right? No, okay, see. Wait, what's up here? Gross raising canes. Don't mind this. <laughs> Don't mind this at all. Don't mind any of this. Okay, I think everything is cool. Okay, one has to go cartoon edition. And let's go. Let's let's see. One has to go main character. So, uh, it has to be Peppa Pig, right? So, okay, this is um, this is Owl House, right? I think this is Owl House. Steven Universe, Peppa Pig, SpongeBob. I'm not getting rid of SpongeBob. I'm not getting rid of Steven Universe. So it's between Peppa Pig and whoever this is. I never watched Owl House, but I I went to one of these days. I don't know, man. Though. <laughs> never mind. I don't know. The <laughs> the fan base is kind of wild to me. I, I'm always a defender of the fan base does not make or break a show, but they could be a lot. They could be a lot. <laughs> Maybe that's what the Steve Universe fan base was. I just never noticed because I was like, you know, a fan of Steve Steve Universe, and typically. I'm able to steer clear of fan bases, but some of the Owl House has snuck, snuck into my uh, view. Um, but no, I had to be Peppa Pig. No offense, Peppa Pig, but... Uh, no, nah, nah, it has to be. It has to be. Also, you know what? Down below, uh, tell me you like what you would get rid of for each one of these. But yeah, Peppa Pig. Uh, one has to go Pixar movies. Coco, Toy Story, Luca, or instead of maybe Luca. Oh no, not Luca, not Luca. Probably Coco, because I haven't watched Luca yet. So I'm I'm assuming once I pick it, it's gone right now. And since I haven't watched Luca, I do want to watch Luca. I don't want it to go. I don't know why I haven't watched Luca. I'm gonna watch Luca. <laughs> I'm gonna watch Luca. Maybe like even right after this video. <laughs> um, but I do want to watch Luca. Coco was cool. The art was really beautiful. Um, ah, I can't remember the movie now, but I remember, wasn't there like a whole shot of the underworld or whatever? That was like really nice looking. But movie as a whole, wasn't the biggest fan. It's Toy Story, you can't get rid of Toy Story. Inside Out, I feel like it's one of the best Pixar movies. If I could just think on the top of my head. So yeah, either Coco or Luca. No, I'll, I'll go with Luca. i go with Luca. I don't think, I don't think, uh, all right, I have to go with Luca. I'm going with Luca. Okay. Uh, next, miraculous characters. Never watched Miraculous Ladybug. I don't. I don't really care. Uh, I know this one. All right, you can't see my mouse. Yeah, I know this one. I know this one. I don't know who the fuck these guys are, but I am a fan of redheads. So, blue hair dude, you gotta go. Uh, what's? Uh, don't look at these. Don't look at these. So there's a lot, by the way. Agent, okay. I don't know. I don't know why I look down like <laughs> like that was gonna help me. Okay, next up wants to go Avatars, Aang, Katara, Kyoshi, right? And Ro Ro. Ah oh, fuck! <laughs> I'm a fake fan. <laughs> is Ro Ro? Is it Roku? No, it's not Roku. Is it? What's his name? Roshi? I don't know. Um. I mean, probably the one's name I can't remember. <laughs> I mean, right? Ang is cool. Uh, did I say Katara? 
I think I said Katara. I mean Korra. Um, Angus cool. Korra. Korra's all right. Um, I don't hate Korra as much as other people. I will say, here's what I'll say. Just real quick about the show. I still have a lot of problems with the show. But it's nowhere near as bad as I remember when I was in um, high school. Like, nowhere near. Uh, I will say maybe the villains really carry that show. But Legend of Korra is not that bad. But it's probably... That, he starts with an R. Right? He he starts with an R. <laughs> uh, I'm pretty sure if I look down, everyone's going to say Korra, right? Let's see. Let's see. But useless, I mean Korra. Yoshi. Did you say anything other than Korra? No, nah, man. I think Roku. I knew it. It is Roku. It is Roku. Okay. <laughs> Not going to worry. Roku he has to go. Yeah, one. Yeah. Uh, I don't think it's Korra, man. I mean, I would just talk about characters that we like. Like, okay, look. I will say we could live without Legend of Korra. Right, we we could definitely live without it, but when it comes to like living without a certain character, I mean, Roku's cool. Of course, Roku really helped Ang's character, but like I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. It's either Roku or Korra. I think Ang is safe, Kyoshi is safe. It's it's one of these two. I'm leaning more towards Roku. Okay, let's well, to go. Twenty twenty one movies, the Mitchells versus the world, or whatever the fuck. One of these is Raya, Luca. Um, I don't fucking know, man. <laughs> this one. <laughs> this one. I go with this one. Fuck it. I, I don't care. I like this movie. I need to watch Luca. I don't give a fuck. I really don't have an opinion about this. But maybe this one. Whoever that is. Recent show. Shira, Fendi Train, and Amphibia, and Our House. Fendi Train and Our House are safe. Because I want to watch both of those, especially Affinity Train. Uh, Shira? I've not heard shit about Amphibia. I've definitely seen this character, but I don't think I ever knew what show the I'm assuming she came from. And I've heard a bit about Shira, but it's a lot of like. People like it, people don't like it. But at the same time, I feel like a lot of people who don't like it are like the type of people I'm not trying to really align myself with. <laughs> um, so I don't know. I'll go with... I'm going to go with Amphibia. I think Amphibia has to go. Because Shu's art style is the type of art style that I, I kind of like. I kind of like it. Um, while Amphibia, Amphibia, no offense. No offense. Really no offense. It's a lot like a lot of other art styles from uh, cartoons that I do watch already. And that's not, I'm not going to say it's a bad thing. But, you know, sometimes you, it's like, I always explain this. If you ever eat ramen, if you eat ramen a lot um, via stovetop, if you cook ramen on the stovetop, especially if you've done it for, I don't know, like months, I want you to right now get up, go make ramen, and put it in the microwave. I'm telling you. When you just do a little switch up, something sometimes just tastes good. So sometimes you just want to see some a new art style here and there. That's all I'm saying. See, I think I have to get rid of Amphibia. We we'll have to go preschool show girlies, Peppa Pig, Dora, Sophia, and Doctor Something. I forgot her name. Um, I mean Dora safe. <laughs> Dora safe. Peppa, Peppa Pig is probably safe. Um, I'm gonna go with Sophia. Sophia's gotta go. I can't. I can't. Uh, I can't kick out. I can't vote out. Uh, black girl. This the smart black girl. Can't do it. I'm sorry. I'm that guy. I can't do it. <laughs> it's not gonna be me. It's not gonna be me. <laughs> One has to go. Total drama, guys. Okay. Trent. No. Right, Trent. Trent. I want to say it's Trent. DJ, Owen, and Duncan. Trent, right? That's not Trent. Is this thing Trent? I don't have my phone. I think, I'm pretty sure that's Trent. I'm pretty sure that's Trent. Um, yeah, it has to be Trent. The other ones are too cool. Other ones. Yeah, Trent. Easy. Total Drama Girls. Uh, Courtney. Lashana. 
Heather and Gwen. Oh, Heather. <laughs> Heather. I was gonna say it was hard, but again, I'm not voting on my, my, my black queen. Is Courtney black? Is Courtney black than my black queens? And Gwen is my girl. Uh, I like Heather, but I mean, I'm, I mean, it's just a process of elimination, truly. Unless you go Disney princesses. Okay. Objectively, I'll probably say Tiana, but again, not voting out the black, the black princess. It's not going to be me. Um, oh, God, I didn't remember them like that. Fuck. Um, Tiana, uh, probably the brave princess, right? Um, maybe. What's her name? Meredith? I think it's Meredith. Meredith? Meredith? Something like that. Yeah, I think Meredith has to go. Yeah, Mulan's the hero. I like Frozen. I like uh, Moana. Ariel's a, pr Ariel's a princess. <laughs> Ariel's a princess. Can't get rid of her. Never went out. Tiana, of course. Yeah, I, probably Meredith. I'm sorry, Meredith. I think, I think just a process of elimination. Truly, <laughs> my bad. Uh, Team Avatar. Sokka, Tofka. Oh fuck me. Oh fuck me, man. <laughs> um, Katara, 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 Katara has to go. <laughs> I think Katara has to go. Sokka's my boy. Tough is cool. Aang. It's either Katara or Aang, to be completely honest with you. But I think I'm leaning towards uh Katara. Hold on. Okay, I thought I had a message. Okay, girl franchises, uh, monster high, whatever the fuck, my little pony, brats, that, <laughs> whatever the fuck that is, <laughs> that has to go. Um, I guess I can explain more. I, I don't. I never like really watched these two. I was a. I'll admit it. I I was a brony. I was a brony when I was thirteen. Right? Yeah, about like 13 to 15, I would say. I was really into My Little Pony. Uh, I mean, I will still say to this day, I like it, I guess. I've never finished. I do need to finish it. I do. I feel like I need to finish it for the simple fact that I spent so much of my life watching that. That at this point, I just need to actually finish it. Um, but yeah, so My Little Pony was already safe. Uh, uh, at least it's like, these two are just... I don't think I've watched it, but I just feel like it'll be a type of show that when you are really bored out of your mind, you might see a movie of it um, on Netflix and be like, yeah, sure, I'll watch it. I'll, I'll spend my next hour and 49 minutes watching this. And I just don't know what the fuck this is. I truly have no idea what that is. I have, I have no idea what that is. Okay. When has to go, Frozen or Big Hero 6? So, okay, so here's the problem, right? I haven't watched the Big Hero 6 show. I did watch Frozen 2. Frozen 2 was not good. Meaning, they kind of, like, they already kind of canceled each other out. Frozen uh, did a lot for me when I was in middle school. I won't say it came out when I was in middle school. Uh, like, their songs, they used to bop their songs a lot. Hell, even, even now, randomly, I would just, like, look up one of the Frozen songs and just bopped that shit for a while. Big Hero 6 was my favorite movie of... When did Big Hero 6 come out? Did Big Hero 6 come out in 2016? Hold on. Big Hero 6 came out in 2014 and 2013. Okay, interesting. Okay, so Big Hero 6 came out in 2014. Rosa came out in 2013. I, I don't know, man. I might be here at six. I think Big Hero Six has to go. I, I watched Frozen more than Big Hero Six, so that must mean something, right? I will say I really did enjoy Big Hero Six. Go Go, I want to say her name was my man. She was like my biggest crush for that year. <laughs> um, but I think I think Big Hero Six has to go. And you know, I'm also looking up for Disney. You know, 
Frozen was the biggest thing since fucking Mickey Mouse for Disney. So, I mean, I, you know, I'm looking out. I'm looking out for the company. <laughs> um, but yeah, I think that's... Once that to go, Sensational Six. Is that their name? Is that their team name, Sensational Six? There's no way. Um, uh, probably, uh, Pluto or Daisy. You can't, oh, you can't get rid of the, the trio. You can't get rid of Mickey, Goofy, or Daffy. I think at this point, Minnie Mouse, well, it's the Red Bird, like, part of the Sensational Six. Um, no, sorry. It's, Minnie Mouse is proud of, probably, I'm not going to say as popular as Mickey Mouse, sorry. But, you know, it's Minnie Mouse. You know Minnie Mouse. Well, I feel like Daisy is kind of the odd person out. Like, even more than Pluto. Because you, you know Pluto. I feel like people typically forget about Daisy. So I think I have to say Daisy. I think Daisy's the one out. What are you guys saying? Minnie? All of them? Daisy, Daisy, Daisy. Da okay, yeah. Okay, I'm not crazy then. I think we're almost done. The Looney Tunes. All of them are just the ones in the picture. Um... It can't be Porky, can't be Buzz, can't be Daffy, can't be... T I mean, it has to be this dude, right? What's his name? Oh, f I'm sorry, I can't remember his name, but it has to be him, right? It has to be, it has to be, it has to be. Wants to go, Spider-Man to the Spider-Verse or Shrek. I mean... Uh, okay, so Shrek is a legitimately good movie. Well, I know it's, it's kind of a meme at this point, but Shrek is a legit good ass movie. Uh, Spider Man Into the Spider Verse is also a legit good ass movie. Miles Morales is my second favorite Spider Man since I was like 12, right? I'm gonna say like 12, 13 at most. There, like, there was a point where. <laughs> By the way, if you guys don't know this, when I was like middle school and high school, I was like the biggest fucking asshole when it came to comic books. Like, I thought I just knew more than everyone. Which, I mean, I, I still think I know more than the average person. But for some reason, I just like, I was basically like borderline gatekeeper. <laughs> I was a borderline gatekeeper back then. Um, if you're a gatekeeper, stop it. <laughs> Grow up. Um, but yeah, when, when I first heard of Miles, I was like, yeah, man. And what, oh. And I want to say eventually Spider Man. So that had to be uh, it was years later, cause it was yeah that was years later, cause it was like what 2015 something when Spider Man was announced he was coming to the MCU. So when I heard that, and I was still like really big on Miles back then, which I still am, but it was he was at his peak back then. And I was like, yeah man, I really want to <laughs> Miles Morales instead of Peter Parker. And then I thought I really wanted Childish Gambino to be Miles. Uh, then I realize how old childish gabino is and that was not gonna work out um but yeah i was really excited when i saw spider verse uh into the spider verse coming out because again my boy miles uh i've been saying i can't vote on my black people i also feel like if i vote i strike some somehow some way like the fuck a butterfly effect is gonna i don't know man it's gonna make it so that the spider verse movie just never existed somehow some way um but for saying that we're kicking movies out like right now, like at this very second, it will be a race if we can never see it again, then I'm gonna go with Shrek gotta go. But for saying that we're gonna go back in time as Shrek was never created at all, then into the spider verse I gotta go. That's my answer. Okay, wants to go for your all parents to Jimmy Neutron. Um I haven't watched Fairy Odd Parents in a while. And I haven't watched Jimmy Neutron even longer than that. Um I was gonna say I always think I enjoy just like turn on an episode of Fairy Odd Parents. But I feel like it, that had definitely changed by the end of its life cycle. Jimmy Neutron. Boy genius. I'm gonna go with Fairy Odd Parents. I mean no, I'm gonna go with Jimmy Neutron. That has to go. Fairy Odd Parents stays. I think that's the move. I, I think that'll be my. I feel like that is my most controversial take so far. 
I, I honestly, I really do. <laughs> I think all my other ones have been pretty, pretty in, in line. I think that one is going to be like, oh, this fucking guy. Okay. Wants to go longer on the show. Uh, SpongeBob, Simpsons, Family Guy, or American Dad. American Dad is dang. I really enjoy American Dad's my favorite Seth MacFarlane show. Not the biggest fan of Family Guy, but it's like, that's a show that I can always turn on and just, you know, like just enjoy my life <laughs> for 20 something minutes. You know, I'm not hating on it, but I'm not exactly like, yeah, this is this is a really entertaining show. It's just it's one of those shows where you can just turn on, just like enjoy yourself, you know. Um, uh, I'm gonna get a lot of hate for this. I think I'm gonna get a lot of hate for this. I, I think I think Simpsons got to go. I, I yeah, I think Simpsons got to go. I think Simpsons. Is no longer uh no no longer is like even touching his heyday, right? Like I I mean I'm not sure. I'm I'm not gonna say I'm not gonna stand here and pretend like I'm the like the fucking Simpsons aficionado, right? But when was the last time they had an episode that was even anywhere close to some of the Simpsons best episodes? Um yeah, I just I don't know. I, it would feel weird. Here's what I say. If uh, Family Guy or um, American Dad, if either of those shows go, I don't think I would like feel weird with it just not being around. But if Simpsons or SpongeBob were to go, I would legitimately be like, "Yo, this feels, this feels kind of weird." Really watching a lot of these cartoons and just knowing that Simpsons nor SpongeBob is no longer a thing. But I think I'll have to go with Simpsons. I changed. I changed my mind. Whoever this one is, no longer my most controversial take. I think the Simpsons got to go with. I think so. I think I have to go with that one. I have to go back through all your characters. I don't. Oh, this is the last one because I don't fucking remember these people. <laughs> um, man, I was a child. How old was I? No order the six. Hold on. I said no order the six. I was four. I was four years old when that show came out. I didn't even move to like the first state. <laughs> Wait. No, that was sorry. I haven't. I didn't move to this state I'm currently in yet. When I was watching Backyard Against, so I've been here for a while. Let's just say that I've been here for a while. Um, it just it just ended 2013. Uh, well, 2013 is a while ago. As, what was that? Eight years? It's been eight years. I don't know why. <laughs> Man, time flies. <laughs> um, yeah, uh, probably, probably this chick. I remember. I think I was like a really big fan of this guy. And if I remember right, Homeboy was rarely in the fucking show, right? Like he was like kind of just a special guest. <laughs> At least that's how it felt like to me when I was a, a baby. <laughs> Um, but yeah, those are my, I guess, my hot takes. I don't know what you want to call it. Um, but yeah, if you guys know any more things like this, um, where one has to go, uh, that I could do, anime, video games, whatever, let me know. Uh, make sure you hit that like button and subscribe. Comment down below what all of these things, what you would uh, kick out. And yeah, make sure to join the Discord. You can follow me on Twitter. Uh, you, it was just here. Uh, Oh man, I've been blocking it this whole time. Uh, let me just chase API as you can see over there. Six, six, six. And yeah, um, I'll see you guys next time. This is Chase or Sean. I don't care anymore. Signing off. Peace.